Let's get into it, shall we? I've got this phone case. Hey, look. I don't see anything. Really? Black on my end. Thanks for the luck, Vortex. Let me just check out the... Yeah. <laughs> I cannot speak! Uh, let's see, which one goes... Oh yeah, Athletic Raceways first, apparently. Yeah, I can't do... Okay. Which is odd, because I had no problem booting up the uh, webcam. I can see absolutely fine. Well, I guess it's just on everyone else's end or something. I don't know what it is. Uh, Let me just... Do... Okay. A major lag on Discord, oh, man, what the heck? But let me just get the uh, motion thing ready to go. Let's see what athletic race we looks like now though I did watch a bit of beans of ghost of you stream so half four I've already had my Christmas dinner wow it's a bit early for that Well, Christmas lunch, you know, as I like to call it, because we usually have it. Whoa, look at that trophy in the background. That is cool. And this is a five lap track, which means it's extremely short. I would like to know why there are pokies on this track. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Michael won't be joining us since he's doing stuff with the USK. Yes, he is. I'll probably do one more lap of this one just to make it a little easier. Oh, look, soccer ball chomps. And I don't get why the Goombas are facing the wrong way. Oh, soccer chumps. Alrighty then, so... Or oh, soccer bombs. Really? <laughs> okay, according <laughs> to the alphabetical list, it looks like the update for uh, Celestial Ruins is next. In the showcase. Makes me wonder how some of these tracks are going to look. Yeah, I've also got some uh, snacks for later. Okay. Why is Astacor still here? Because uh, the removal lists are just garbage, apparently. Like, the ones for this update. I mean, come on, seriously? Unless the author requested Moo Moo Farm, the author of Moo Moo Farm to be removed. Ugh. What else did they remove? Um... Hold on, let me pull up. They removed Nostalgic Bowser's Castle, Sunset Raceway. Oh, this track looks pog. 
for this update. Lakeside Hill, Volcanic Pipe Yard, and Volcanic Skyway 4. Well, Volcanic Skyway 4, that's good. Same with Volcanic oh. Skyway 2. Yeah, that's really good. Oh, you won't believe what I got today. Oh, wow, now this has the Mushroom so Gorge music, okay. For the Beast 64. I, as I have told you, I've got a new phone case. Fog? Uh. Do you know what else I got? What? Super Mario 3D All Stars. Nice! And. Paper Mario the Origami King. Double Pog. I like how there's no split pads now on this track. Really? Oh yeah, I think I saw that. That's interesting. Oh, it's not the first time. Uh, I think that's the first time a CT's ever had something like that. I mean, I know like one of Darky Benji's Rainbow Road textures has wire circuit underneath it. So it looks yeah, like now it's time to see what Desert it. Fort has to offer. Oh, I I also got a uh, little handheld. Old game that has the original Super Mario Brothers. Oh, you mean the Mario Gaming Watch? Yeah. I have that right next to me. Yeah, I have that, which also has Super Mario Brothers The Lost Level. So yeah, good, yeah, good luck to me. If I end up doing that. What else did I get? Oh, I also got Bird Bingo. Never heard of that. Cool. And you're doing Desert Fort next. This is typical drawers for you. Note to self, I have played this track in Hack Pack, so I kind of know the layout. Ooh. This is a lot more refined. Mm. Two, one, let's go. Yeah, for once. Yeah, for once. Imagine getting we are uh, really bumped by a CPU. I do hear that, uh, what's it called? That there's a custom blooper effect on this course that's kind of interesting. I haven't seen it yet. At least I thought someone told me that. Now get this, that wall right there you can go through, but I won't be. Oh dear. Room 3 has an inappropriate name. DM me the name. There were two blue two shells this blue race. Two blue shells in one lab. Yeah, in one oh. lab, since it's, um... Or two blue shells in a row. Left in 30 seconds. I mean, come on. Oh my god! That is an interesting blooper effect. Dry bones. <laughs> oh yeah, I also had... Oh my god. Damn it. Well, I get ready to go to Fishtom Island. Th that person's the host too? Oh my! Yay! 
But when I get on CTO lights, I might want to try and avoid that room. Anyway, if anyone's new to the chat, feel free to follow. Let me see this. Whoa! Wow, this truck looks good. Oh my god. Yeah, that is an inappropriate name. Not saying it out loud. That yeah, don't. That is a something temple. I saw a sign for what looks like to be another CT or something. I didn't see what the first word was. <laughs> oh yeah, I did change my Revo card to the one I have in version pack one, but changed the uh, final lap jingle to the Mario Kart 8 one. Hey, this track finally looks good. Yeah, after what feels like a million years. Oh, don't tell me that lava pillows are going to come out of that thing. I'll find out in CT Bull Bites then. Anyway, it is now time to see Garden of Dreams, which I don't think I've ever seen before. I might have, but I don't remember it if I did. Oh, I got new news. What is this news you speak of? Oh, it's sad. If anything, I think Gardner Dream should be better than... It's getting snow. Ooh, well, unfortunately, it's not a white Christmas out here. But I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. But it's, uh, it's a white Christmas over here. Whoa, hello. This is definitely better than River of Dreams. In my honest opinion. And this is Garden of Dreams. Let's see. How does this track apply? Well, that's a resemblance to Peach Gardens right there. Leaf piles, interesting. A cherry blossom. A yeah, cherry blossom piles. Keep in mind, this isn't online yet. Why does this feel like it's a bit long to be three laps? Look at a little pond. Um, a lap should be around a minute. Well, it looks like it's going to be around there. Yeah, I'm minute one. Around a minute. Um, with... All right, so... A, a typical race... A typical race should come up as, like, three minutes long. Depending on how long the that, track is, or if it's Noob Simulator. Depending on how long it is. Anyway, it's, it's time it's for Quaking really Mad Clips. Track then it should be one or two laps, like Wario Coliseum. And if it's a really short track, it should extend the number of laps to like five or six. Like Baby Park. Like Baby Park. Quacking Mad Cliff. Quaking or quacking, I don't know what it is, but let's see what this is. Let's see, what is it? Looks like a Japanese sort of track. I oh, know it's quaking mad cliff because there's no sea. This looks like it takes place in some sort of woods. Of 
sort of forest. Well, there are some... There are some cliff sides that have forests in them. Including the most dangerous national nature reserve in all of England. Oh my god, the DK Mountain Bridge! And it's at the beginning. Yeah, so... Uh, that'll probably start some people off to some bad races. Especially since... Oh, hello. Th that is definitely faster than going around the other path. And you ran into a ground grin. Nothing I could have done. Oh, those are thwomps, aren't they? Yeah, those are basically the thwomps of this track. Okay, then I think there's a... how many more left? That is a pretty cool track, not gonna lie. There are three uh, more tracks left, and they all step forward or else. Yo, used with the raid! Thank you for that. Jacob, thanks for the host. Wow! How did the uh, talent show go? Mr. Vista, thanks for the follow. <laughs> talent raid. Chloe, thanks for the host. You too as well. Oh my god, I am freaking out inside. Engage <laughs> to oh my god. Michael, thanks for the host. Anyway, for those of you just coming in from Use Talent Show Raid, we are actually doing a run-through of the newest update. We are now on the Sanctuary Sanctuary. Madu, thanks for the host. So we have Chloe, Utopia. Michael, and we also have many followers. I know, right? Vortex? Wow, 26 viewers right at the right off the bat. 26 viewers and new follows. Much appreciated. Merry Christmas to you all as well. Yahoo! Yeah. Uh, what was I going to talk to you about? Oh, I was gonna to talk to you about the uh, most dangerous national nature reserve in England. Oh, in the UK, I think. It's oh, what's it called? Uh, was this called, was in oh, other. Was oh, hold on one second, Freaky. This track was not in CGP until today, but it has been in other packs, like JHFR, I believe. Oh, so PGP is, is called. That's an interesting called? username. Anyway, go ahead. Oh yeah, I was, as I was saying, it's called Axmouth to Library just under cliff. That's the uh, name of the National Niche Reserve. And, well, as you can tell by the name, it goes all the way from Axmouth. It's in Devon, by the way. It, goes, it starts in Devon and ends in... I can't remember where it ends, but anyway, it's... It's a massive national nature reserve. It's a whopping seven miles long. Oh my. Axemuth to library just at the cliffs. And the cliffs like. Also, for those who are new here who might not have yeah, already. Seven, no, seven miles. Um, yeah, it's seven miles long. Feel free to join that. It's. It's best gone to in summer with all the uh, migrant birds, and you can also see stuff like razor bills, puffins. And How funny that this is a winter themed track! And even get up close views of um, gannets. <laughs> I guess we're just turning into more of a screen of marathon now. But it's extremely <laughs> dangerous. As What's up, Michael? Know why? Why is it um, dangerous? Because it's so dangerous because it, it well, it's a giant cliff on the edge of the sea. 
Um, uh. I just said it's really prone to landslides, so. Well, if I go to that one, I might want to so avoid that section. Go, go there at your own risk. If I ever go to the UK, okay. that is. Also, once you enter it, you cannot leave unless you visit it to the full. There's been many series of deaths in the area due to landslides, either crushing them or people falling off the cliff because it's crumbled away. Oh. So, yeah. Then I probably don't want to go there. Yeah, that's a... That's your disturbing thought for the day. <laughs> Even though there shouldn't really be one. <laughs> All right, okay. I believe. Yeah, now it's time for the. Uh... Now that I've talked about, now that I've talked about that, let's talk about something else. Let's talk about Christmas presents. What does everyone get? Well, you know me. I don't celebrate Christmas, but last night my cousin got me a shirt okay. and a blanket from her school. Oh. Oh. I I'm still technically waiting on mine. They're still being mailed over. Okay. Well, Purple, I actually happen to be on the uh, last track of the showcase. As for me, I've got an, a new phone case. Which is a, uh, it's like a, it's a Game Boy case. Which takes me back to the days of having a Game Boy Advance. I had one once too, it was an Ooh. SP. But unfortunately, it basically died, but I... Ironically, with the Game Boy Player, I can still use the Game Boy Advance Link Cable. The Game Boy Player on the GameCube, that is. And I also got... You won't believe this, Michael. Um... Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Oh, uh... Actually, that's in the other room. Uh, I have it in the other room. He also um, got another game. Not in my script. Yeah, yeah, I got a like, new stuff. Uh, yeah, I also got Paper Mario the Origami Kid. Have you played through it yet? I, I just got it, okay? What, it was a reasonable question. No, I will begin a playthrough of it later. I. Hey look, it's an Eevee! There's my play. Oh, it's a Flareon! Oh, Flareon. Purple, would it, would it help if I made a command with your FC in case viewers ever want to join your rooms? When I happen to be streaming? Yeah, no, wait. EGP is Pog. Is that you, Sam? It's not, I hate you, real you. It is not them. Okay, let me add that. Now what? Are you going into... Purple's actually going to be opening a room. Okay. 